I met Forrest over 25 years ago, my heart is so lit up. I mean, when I found family, and I am uh, eternally grateful for all the years that I have had the fortune um, and been so blessed to share my life with Forrest uh, as a friend and uh, sharing a, a similar path um, that work is love made visible for the growing. Um, when you love your work, it's not work, it's love. And as Richard mentioned, um, breathing in rose will forever remind me of Forrest or my little vials that you would give me every time I saw him. And he's a magician, so he's here with his magic, which of course I'm going to try not to cry because I know he would have been So I have a stream of consciousness that I uh, downloaded when I was uh, up in Osceola um, a few weeks ago. And um, I'd like to share that for Horst. Teacher, student, soul connected, birthing and growing our businesses, our lives expanding our collective consciousness, sharing a love for organic living, paving the way for food, fashion, and a beauty revolution, our countless times together laughing, learning, sharing, being, from rose oil to sacred geometry, from late night hair treatments, <laughs> to Romeo's opening in Ireland, to Anaheim Natural Products Expos, and our shared passions for art, world change, and a green sheep and healthy planet. Artistic intelligence married with manifestation, disrupting and delighting. Home away from home at 1 5th Avenue. That vibrate, the vibration of our quantum connection, like electric currents in our unified field. Every reflection and affirmation of our concurrent frequency. The whole, my soul ignited, our collective source, the truth. The rhythm and pulse of passion fueling change, tuning in, embracing, trusting, the visual to the experiential, into the sea of self. Dark to light, the polarity of creation, timeless, effortless, vast and consistent, with infinite potential. Beauty radiating, freedom emanating, one love culminating in the curation of shared magic on 11-11-11. Just as a little side note, um, when I got engaged to my husband Eric in 2010, uh, we said, let's get married on 11-11-11. And of course, I paused and said, wait, we can't do that. There's going to be a celebration of the horse, of course. So we let it go. And on 11-11-11, at Horse 70th birthday party, Horse said, Come on, Marcy, let's have a wedding. <laughs> and was our best man as we got married and shared that very special, very, very special um, evening. And I was so honored and grateful. Um, and 11, 11, 11 will forever remain uh, deep in my heart and soul. Eternally grateful, devoted, here to serve as serving others and serving ourselves, of course, would always say, and expanding horse legacy, the eco renaissance, the voice of renewal and rebirth. I will miss you, my friend, and will continue the good work to heal the planet and humanity. Thank you for all of your endless inspiration, mentorship, love, and friendship. I love you.